This video tutorial will teach you how to use the Any Meeting screen feature to share what you are doing with your desktop with your audience. When you're ready to begin screen sharing, we just click the Screen Share button found here. Once you click on it, an Options menu should appear. In this menu, you can select which monitor screen that you would like to share if you are using a multi-monitor setup. Keep in mind that this will show everything that you see on that desktop. Or, we can select a single application to share. Keep in mind that the selected application must always be active and not be covered by any other windows or else the screen sharing will be paused. Now, when we have selected what we want to share, we can start screen sharing. As soon as you start screen sharing, your browser window will automatically minimize and, if your speakers are turned on, you should hear a voice recording notifying that screen sharing has started. You will also hear a voice notification if your screen sharing has been paused or stopped. You should also notice the screen sharing widget that appears, which gives you the ability to still chat with your audience and see a preview of the screen sharing feed that your audience sees. The screen sharing widget will appear as a black box to the audience during screen sharing. The widget can be moved around anywhere on the screen and can even be minimized if you do not wish to display a black box to the audience. You can choose to turn off the sound notifications that tell you whether screen sharing started or stopped by bringing up the browser window that the meeting is held on, clicking on the icon with the speaker on it shown right here, or turn it back on by clicking on the icon again. If you click on this icon here with a question mark on it, this will bring up a window that will give tips and guidelines to help you properly share your screen. First off, you want to make sure to use a wired connection for the best results. Also, you're going to want to go slowly. The frame rate for screen sharing is not the same that you're seeing on your monitor. If you do things too quickly, some of it may be lost to your attendees. We also definitely recommend setting your desktop resolution to 1280 by 1024 or lower. This will make sure that screen sharing is much more easily visible and lighten the load on you and your attendees' internet connections. You can now minimize your browser interface to begin showing what it is that you would like to share. Attendees will see your screen or your shared application fill the middle area of their panel. They're also going to have some options to change how they can view the screen sharing if they hover their mouse over the screen sharing feed. Now keep in mind that only presenters or attendees that you have allowed to share can share their screen and only one participant can ever be sharing their screen at any one time. To promote someone else to be a presenter or keep them as an attendee but allow them to share their screen, let's click the name in the attendee list and select that option in the menu that appears. That's it for our screen sharing tutorial. Have a great day.